Hey there, I'm Richard Brandt, Monos Historian, and you're watching Stream It Now. In case you hadn't noticed, Amazon Prime has actually been relatively restrained lately about ladling on the new arrivals, but that all changed today with this onslaught of new titles featuring the sci-fi thriller Agent, Blake Lively in the drama All I See Is You, the paranormal documentary American Ghost Hunter, the same-sex romance Arizona Sky, from 1937, Cary Grant and Irene Dunn in Leo McCary's Oscar-winning screwball classic, The Awful Truth. The Croatian drama, Baba. Michael Fassbender in the World War I story, A Bear Named Winnie. The paranormal thriller, Beautiful Prison. Charlton Heston lent his voice to the animated version of Ben-Hur from 2000. James Wilby as George VI in Bertie and Elizabeth. One of the most controversial movies made still after a century or more, D.W. Griffith's The Birth of a Nation, the Kino Restored Edition, the hate crime drama Bomb City, Christy Swanson and Danny Glover in The Bouquet, Killian Murphy in Neil Jordan's Breakfast on Pluto. Adrian Paul in Bokeem Woodbine. They're vampire cops in The Breed. Sting is Victor Frankenstein and Jennifer Beals is The Bride. Albert Finney in the 1994 version of The Browning Version. From 1937, Ray Milland takes his turn as the title detective in Bulldog Drummond Escapes. Michelle Trachtenberg in the romance Can't Be Heaven. Jenna Rollins in Joan Micklin Silver's Charms for the Easy Life. Just in time for the holidays, Christmas on Salvation Street. Aaron Kwok and Andy Lau in the Hong Kong cop saga Cold War. Sasha Alexander in the romantic comedy Coming and Going. The horror thriller, The Conduit. The romantic comedy, Country Remedy. The romantic thriller, Dangerous Obsession. The supernatural thriller, Daylight. DC 9-11, Time of Crisis, stars Timothy Bottoms as George W. Bush and is directed by the legendary Brian Trenchard Smith. The Czech comedy sequel, Dedictvi Aneb Kurva Se Nerika. The Portrait of a Tortured Artist, The Devil and Daniel Johnston. From 1974, Glenn Ford and Bradford Dillman in the UFO thriller, The Disappearance of Flight 412. French Stewart in the family comedy, Dog Gone. Double Doses of Horror, Sinister Artists, and Cave Beats gives us two movies written by Charles B. Griffith, Roger Corman's beat classic, A Bucket of Blood, and Monty Hellman's slightly less celebrated, Beast from Haunted Cave. From 1920, John Barrymore in the silent classic, Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. In Earthbound, Rafe Spall stars as a young man whose dad convinces him he just might be an alien. Edge of America stars James McDaniel in an Emmy-winning performance, well, daytime Emmy, as a new teacher on the reservation. Endgame stars William Hurt and Chiwetel Ejiofor in a story about the last days of apartheid. Edward James Olmos narrates the deportee documentary Exile Nation, The Plastic People. Fall Guy is a low-budget mob drama from 1962. In 1975, Robert Mitchum was just right as world-weary Philip Marlowe in Dick Richards' Farewell, My Lovely. Ben Wheatley's historical horror thriller, A Field in England. The food documentary, Fresh. The mystical documentary, Gateways to Fairy. The ensemble drama, Go With You. Stephen Baldwin 
Corbin Burnson and Lorenzo Lamas in the faith-based drama God's Club, from a director better known for making Asylum mockbusters, Jared Cohn. The animated feature The Great Bear from 1973, Ryan O'Neill, Ann Archer, and Omar Sharif in the heist thriller Green Ice. From 1944, Ann Baxter and Lewis Milestone's drama Guest in the House. Gilda Radner and Gene Wilder in the spy thriller Hanky Panky. Don Swayze in the western Heathens and Thieves. The documentary Hitler's Eastern Front, Army Group South. Burt Reynolds in the thriller Hollow Creek. The Dutch comedy Home is Where Your Heart Is. The crime thriller Homies. Lee Frost's nudie cutie classic, House on Bear Mountain. A woman fights for her liberty in the documentary, I Am Slave. James Woods, Glenn Close, and Mary Stuart Masterson in the drama, Immediate Family. Lacey Chabert in the thriller, In My Sleep. The Two Daddies drama, In the Family. Mickey Rourke, Kim Basinger, and Billy Bob Thornton had an ensemble cast in The Informers, the supernatural thriller Interior. From 1960, It Happened to Jane, stars Doris Day and Jack Lemmon as a couple fighting a railroad tycoon, played by Ernie Kovacs and based not too subtly on Charles Foster Kane. The true story of the Jewish Cardinal the Scandinavian fable Journey to the Christmas Star, the apocalyptic thriller The Last Survivors, the same-sex romance The Last Year, Emily Mortimer in the historical drama Leone, the micro and macro photography documentary Limits of Perception, the faith-based comedy The Lost and Found Family, the faith-based drama Love Covers All. Fran Kranz in the romantic comedy Lust for Love. Eric Romer's classic The Marquise of O. Shannon Elizabeth in the rescue dog drama Marshall's Miracle. Dana Carvey is the master of disguise. The animated feature Maya the Bee the John Muir Trail documentary, Mile, Mile and a Half. A teen confronts the Latvian justice system in Modris. Abel Ferrara's violent revenge thriller, Ms. 45. Demi Moore, Bruce Willis, Glenn Hedy, and Harvey Keitel in the Rashomon-like crime drama, Mortal Thoughts. The French crime thriller, Murders in Brats. Juliette Lewis and Michael Cera in the drama, My Louisiana Sky. The family fantasy, My Magic Dog. Glenn Close, Holly Hunter, and Sissy Spacek lead an ensemble cast in Nine Lives. Ryan Reynolds, Hope Davis, and Melissa McCarthy in a psychological thriller, The Nines. David Strathairn tracks down anarchist bombers in the historical drama No God, No Master. Emmy Rossum in the drama Nola. A portrait of two Holocaust survivors, Oma and Bella. The family comedy Operation Dalmatian, The Big Adventure. The Alternate history thriller, Outpost 11, the sort of sequel, The Prince and Me, The Royal Honeymoon. The Russian supernatural thriller, Queen of Spades, The Dark Right. Lena Headey in the World War I drama, The Red Baron. Austin O'Brien in the L.A. street story, Runaways. The sort of classic family movie, Savannah Smiles. See What I'm Saying, the Deaf Entertainers documentary. The vampire thriller, Shadowland. The nature documentary, Sky Hunters, The World of the Dragonfly. 
B.D. Wong, Jennifer Coolidge, Bronson Pinchot, and a seal in Slappy and the Stinkers. Joel Edgerton in the Australian neo-noir The Square. James Wilby again in A Summer Story, a melancholy drama co-starring Imogen Stubbs. She's not Imogen Poots, but she'll do. Melissa Gilbert and Richard Farnsworth in the story of a girl and her horse, Sylvester. From 1980, a version of A Tale of Two Cities starring Chris Sarandon and Peter Cushing. Things Change, starring Donna Amici and Joe Mantegna in David Mamet's surprisingly soft-hearted mob story. Threesome stars Lara Flynn Boyle, Josh Charles, and Stephen Baldwin, and if that isn't a dream threesome, the time-lapse documentary, Time Limits. Anthony Anderson lends his voice to the animated feature, A Turtle's Tale, Sammy's Adventures. The documentary, The Voyage Code, the world's most mysterious manuscript. Gary Bond, Donald Pleasance, and Jack Thompson in Ted Kotcheff's Outback classic, Wake in Fright. The surf documentary, Walking on Water. The AIDS documentary, We Were Here. Emmanuel Vaugier and Shelley Long in The Wedding Chapel. Colin Firth and Jim Broadbent in the sobering drama, When Did You Last See Your Father? And a documentary about prison inmates tasked with busting broncos, The Wild Horse Redemption.